Hey everyone, it's Becky. I am back with another fun build. Today I made a school. I made Becky Town Primary School. So this is a lower level elementary school. I made three classrooms, a kindergarten, a first grade, and a second grade class. This is the front of the building here. Over here on the left we have a little friendship garden. Really cute, lots of colorful flowers. And here is the main entrance, just a little bit of bushes here, and our sign, and here is the main entrance with the office over there on the right side. Let's head inside. Here we are in the Becky Town Primary School. We will head over here into the main office first. This is the secretary's desk. We have some trophies that the school has earned. A little spot for people to sit, and in here... No one wants to go in here, but this is the principal's office. Our mascot here is the tiger, so we have used some orange paint around here to keep up with the school spirit. Next, we can head on over to the left, and over here is our library and our cafeteria. A couple of little signs here, and we can go in the cafeteria first. Here it is. We just have a couple of long tables and benches in here. A little spot here for kids to prepare their meal if they brought in a cold lunch. And over here is the hot lunch section. Today we have hot dogs, fruit, and milk. And the kitchen back here for the cafeteria workers. A few nice school lunch posters here and a healthy plate poster over here. Our drinking fountain here next to the library. I don't know about you guys, but I used to love when the Scholastic Book Fair came, so we have a few posters here advertising that. I also was a big accelerated reader person. Um, I always used to get some of the most points out of my whole grade, and we had a little AR store come around where we could earn little prizes, and I used to be able to get so many prizes because I read so many books. <laughs> so this is like the more picture book section, and over here is some of the bigger books for the older kids. And a couple of beanbag chairs, a nice circle rug, and a little bench area for reading. There's actually a few new school themed items coming out in the workshop just in the past couple days while I've been finishing up this build, so this little bookshelf here is perfect. This is the main hallway that leads down to our classrooms. We have some artwork up here from the students and our lockers. And right here is the art room. Lots of art supplies, art class rules, different shapes and colors posters, some more children's artwork, a nice bulletin board, and our little table for the kids to work at. Really cute, nice and bright in here. We'll pop into the bathrooms real fast before we get into the classrooms. This is the boys' room. A couple of cute Canton Hat and Clifford posters in here. And the girls have Courtney Here, Here's a Who and Rainbow Fish. We will head into the kindergarten first. Super cute and colorful in here. This rug here was a new addition to the workshop as well. Lots of toys. This rug here is obviously the reading area for the teacher to sit in the rocking chair and read. Love these colorful chairs and tables. Another workshop item, oh, a little... um grocery store, Barry the Hamster Pop-Tarts, and Bessie's um, little cereal. So funny. Some educational posters here, numbers, days of the week, weather. Another little play area here. This little easel here is another cute workshop item. Even these pictures up here are workshop items. So yeah, that is the kindergarten room. And over to first grade. Here we are in first grade. Some nice orange accent walls in here. We have some fish in here, some board games and books. Cute insect themed posters. Little two person seats. We have some toys over here. It's sensory bins, another little kitchen set, and a projector, which can change into different modes here. I wish I could actually like insert my own picture to be able to display up here. That'd be a pretty cool feature for them to have. Ah! <laughs> That's a pretty interesting glitch. Um, I don't know where I was standing when I just did that, but... Yeah, okay. 
I can do that again. I knew I could do that from that angle. Let's do it one more time. Whoa. Anyways, um, we have some nice twinkle lights up on the windows, some fluorescent stars up here, and overall just a nice warm, inviting first grade room. And our last classroom here is second grade. This one has a nice um, teal, yellowish, orangish theme to it. I don't know if kids these days learn cursive at all, but we do have a little cursive alphabet up here. Some more books and games and toys. Game bags here. A little desk here. And we also have fish here. This whiteboard here actually looks pretty 3D, which is pretty cool. I really like these hanging stars here. I had them in my kindergarten room too, but they're in the occasional section of the tablet, like the Christmas items, along with these hanging stars here. You're also getting a little sneak peek of the playground out there as well. Another projector up here and just another cozy, nice classroom. So yeah, second, first, and kindergarten rooms, the art room, the main office, the library, and the cafeteria. So we will just go through these cafeteria doors out to the playground and back. This house came with this fun covered back patio area, so I thought it'd be perfect to put a couple of benches and picnic tables out here for outdoor working or eating snacks. These little crayon fences are super cute and add a nice pop of color over here. And here is the playground area. We have some little um, bouncy things here. <laughs> Seesaw, teeter-totter. A couple of big play... A couple of bigger play structures, a merry-go-round. And we have a little sports slab surface here for basketball. Really cute and colorful. I like all these um, kids' playground items. So that is it for Beckytown Primary School. Let me know which classroom was your favorite. Kindergarten, first grade, or second grade. I think this room is my favorite. As always, let me know if you have any requests for any future homes or special builds you want me to do. I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you in my next one. Bye.